Good day everyone, welcome to our lesson in Applied Economics. Our lesson for today is about market demand, market supply, and market equilibrium. This is our lesson 3, and this is for week 3. Our most essential learning competencies are, first, determine the concepts of market demand, supply, and equilibrium. Second, state the laws of demand and supply. Third, construct and analyze demand, supply, and their curves. Fourth, solve problems on demand, supply, and equilibrium. So let's start. A demand or the amount of good or service consumers are willing to purchase at each price. If customers cannot pay for it, there is no effective demand. Price is what a buyer pays for a unit of the specific good or service. And the total number of units purchased at that price is called the quantity demanded. What is law of supply and demand? The law of supply and demand explains the interaction between the sellers of a product and the buyers. Commonly happens in a market or any establishment where, uh, where materials or goods are being sold. What is the law of demand? The law of demand is a fundamental principle of economics that states that at a higher price, consumers will demand a lower quantity of a good. For example, if consumers cannot pay for one sack of rice, they were going to buy at least half a sack of rice just for their needs. Factors affecting demand. First is the income of the buyers. Second, the number of potential buyers. Third, preferences. And fourth, complementary products. What is the law of supply? The higher the price, the quantity supplied, the higher the quantity supplied and vice versa. Factors affecting supply. One, production capacity. Second, production cost such as labor and materials. Third, the number of competitors. Fourth, ancillary factors such as material availability, weather, and reliability of supply chains. Equilibrium price or market clearing price is the price at which the producers can sell all the units he wants to produce and the buyer can buy all the units he wants. For the summary of our lesson, a demand curve shows the relationship between quantity demanded and price in a given market on a graph. The law of demand states that a higher price typically leads to a lower quantity demanded. Supply curve shows the relationship between quantity supplied and price on a graph. The law of supply says that at a higher price, typically leads to a higher quantity supplied. The equilibrium price and equilibrium quantity occur where the supply and demand curves cross. The equilibrium occurs where the quantity demanded is equal to the quantity supplied. If the price is below the equilibrium level, then the quantity demanded will exceed the quantity supplied. And last, excess demand or shortage will exist. If the price is above the equilibrium level, then the quantity supplied will exceed the quantity demanded. And that's the end of our lesson. Thank you for listening. God bless.